Hello, everybody. Welcome back to another episode from networkfromhome.com. Today, we're going to be talking about MAC addresses. And specifically, we're going to be talking about the MAC addresses for your router. The key there, as I said, MAC addresses as opposed to MAC address. The common thought is that your router will have one MAC address, when in reality, most routers actually have three MAC addresses. That's because each network interface on a router will have a MAC address. And your router has a public network interface, a wired network interface for your local network, and then a wireless network interface for your local network as well. That's for your devices accessing Wi-Fi on your no local network. So the bottom line is most routers have three MAC addresses. And the question is, how do we determine what those values are? There are two different ways to do this that we'll go over today. The first one is by simply looking at your router and looking at the information on the sticker on your router, you'll be able to determine one of those MAC addresses for the other two, or to look at all three of the MAC addresses for your router at once, you'll have to log into your router settings. And I'll show you both ways to do that. First, we'll take a look at the router itself and what information is presented on there. Then we'll go into your router, we'll log in. I'll show you what my router looks like. Your router will hopefully look similar, but that will give you all the information you need. So let's start by taking a look at what a router provides or what a router sticker provides on the device itself. Okay, so as we mentioned, first we'll take a look at our router and what MAC address it shows on there. What we need to do is we need to look at the sticker on your router. For most routers, that sticker will be on the bottom of the device. So let me give you a closer look at this and we can find out what our MAC address looks like. Okay, so here is a close up of the sticker on the bottom of my router. As you can see right here is the MAC address listed for the router itself. And it's important to understand and it's not very clear on the device but this MAC address listed here is for the local wired connections to your router. What does that mean? It means that this MAC address is for the interface that's connected to the Ethernet ports on your router. So basically, these four Ethernet ports here, that's what that MAC address on your router sticker is indicating. Okay, now that we have that sorted out, let's take a look at your router settings and log into your router settings. Okay, now that we have the information off of your router sticker for the wired local connections or the wired local interface, let's log into my router and see what the rest of the MAC addresses are for this device. Okay, now that we've looked at the MAC address on the sticker of your router, Let's log into the router settings and look at the three MAC addresses for your router. To do that, we need to first log into your router settings. So let me navigate to where we need to go. My router is at 2.168.0.1. And you'll need to go to your router's default address for its settings. For me, it's at 192.168.0.1. This is a common IP address, but it could be different depending upon the router you have. At this point, we just want to log in, so enter your credentials here. Okay, now that we've logged into our router settings, we just need to go to the Advanced tab and it will show us everything we need to see. So let's click on that now. Okay, 
So we're now in the advanced tab. And as you can see here, the three MAC addresses for your router are clearly laid out. This is your internet or your public facing interface. I've blurred out the IP address and MAC address for this interface because that is security relevant. However, this is where your MAC address will be presented for your public interface, for your physically connected or your wired interface. This is the same MAC address that was listed on the bottom of your router on the sticker. And lastly, here's the wireless interface MAC address. This is for anything that is connecting over Wi-Fi to your router on your local network. And that will be your third MAC address. So this is a great one-stop shop here. It shows all three of your MAC addresses for your router. And I would recommend it as being the easiest way to collect the MAC addresses for your device. Okay, now we've gone over both ways of grabbing MAC addresses for your router. We've talked about how to look at the sticker, how to look at your router's settings for the three MAC addresses three MAC addresses for your router. That should be all you, all you need to know at this point. If you have any questions, please drop a comment below. I will also link to a blog post that pertains to this information. So feel free to check that out. And as always, thanks for joining our Network From Home episode. We'll see you on the next one. Thank you.